It's game four of the NBA Finals. The Bucks have set the tone of the series up two games to one. Can they maintain their composure and take a commending 3-1 lead? Now, the test awaits as they face off against the Suns. The NBA postseason, coming up next. It's the NBA Finals on 2K Sports. The championship is almost within reach, and with the series standing at 2-1, we could be looking at a make-or-break game. Alongside Grant Hill and Clark Kellogg, I'm Brian Anderson. We'll talk to Allie LaForce, who's on the sidelines as well. Allie, it's all yours. Well, guys, we've seen star players forcing their way to new teams. All right, Allie, thanks. the Bucks win the tip. All right, now the opening lineup for Phoenix. We've got Jordan Poole. He's out there with Nicholas Claxton. And it's Richardson in at the small forward position. Second chance points are always painful. Have to make the effort to box out. Hey, guys standing around spectating. I mean, you got to get in there and get tough. Here's Curry. Milwaukee with the rebound. Oh, and a fast break for the Bucks. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot and will go to the line. You take a look at Phoenix. The top seed coming into this final series. But they've had their hands full. They really have. I mean, trailing coming into this game, too. It's critical they even the score tonight to make it a best of three series. A multiple time MVP. You know, what's really scary is that Giannis feels like he can keep getting better. And more importantly, he does the work to get better. The Bucks have gone two of three from the floor. Anadokounmpo, a screen on Curry to the inside. Misses the three. And Curry throws it down. We know Curry has tremendous vision, and he uses it to tee up his teammates for easy shots. Oh, a great look there. Brought to you by the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. Pass to Abaji. Three-pointer. The offensive rebound. Got it. Out of the Kumpo has got five now. Excellent activity and timing on the offensive glass. That's how you get extra possession. Curry against Walker. Side Richardson, cool outside. Shot clock at five. The Suns need to get off a shot. And there's Richards on the assist by Curry. Just taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Now here's Ana Kumpo. Five points in the game. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It's going to go on Jordan Poole. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. And so Honor Kumpo nails both of them. Here in the first quarter, with about two minutes gone by. Pass to Curry. Back to Richardson. Now here's Curry. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Well, that was clearly a foul. Yeah, he took a shot there. Earn those three points. And that one falls for Curry. And so he hits both. Already a very confident player. Knocking down those free throws only fuels that. The Bucks have gone three of six from the floor. away. Curry with a steal. Fast break. Here we go. And down it goes. Dumped 
Sprinted through off a beautiful setup. Good fast-paced play there. It's much easier to find a shot when you beat the defense back. Pass to Anadokounmpo. Here's Abaji. Launches it. And the Bucks miss again. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Richardson to three. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Curry. Richardson's got five points. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. To the middle. It's tipped. To end the run. And it's Richardson with the rebound. Given his range, you'd expect him to capitalize on that opening. Left side Curry. And stolen by Honor Kupo. We're just over three and a half minutes into this first quarter. Back to Walker. Shot clock at six. Milwaukee, no good that time either. You know, he looks a little off kilter to me this quarter. Still trying to find his rhythm. Richardson finds Curry. From behind the arc. And the Suns get it back. Back to Richardson. Second shot opportunity. Gets it to go. Makes him two for five. The big story thus far, how well they've shot the rock. Very high percentage so far. And if you want to start a game hot, that's the way to do it. Here's Abaji. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Such a wide open look. Don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. Phoenix has gone two for four from range to start things off. Pass to Richardson. Shot off. Cool. Second chance shot. It's deflected. Outside Walker. Right wing. Here's Abaji. Three pointer. No good. The Suns leading. Outside Curry. And stolen by Ana de Kupo. All sorts of time. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right iron. He's got five. You know, this is what happens when you combine center size with developing point guard skills. Giannis running the offense to perfection right there. Now here's Curry. He's got six. Pass to Claxton. And here's Curry. Six to shoot. Inside. Here's Richardson. They get it back. Cool. Two shots, two makes. Off to a good start. <laughs> They're not messing around. Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. Milwaukee calls timeout. Different look here. Stanley's checked in for Claxton. Wiggins comes in. Phoenix has gotten five of their nine attempts from deep to go. On the floor for Phoenix. We've got Nicholas Claxton, and it's Aldama in at the four. The Bucks shooting poorly, just 30% so far. Here's Abaji. Three-pointer off the mark. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Yeah, you look across the board, it's actually sizing up, shaping up to be a great game. I mean, strong performances throughout, and they've really been strong on the glass. Curry, no good. That's a shot he'd like, Mac. He's usually going to make those. Takes the three. The Suns clear it. I think he's gone completely dry. Nothing is hitting. And, you know, you can sense his frustration. This is going to be a test of his resolve here. Over to the wing. Let's go with a three. And the basket by Abaji. Not sure what the defense was thinking. I mean, you can't leave this guy open from deep. Curry with it. And Walker picks him up defensively. Lets it go from the wing. And again, it's the Suns missing. 
The Bucks have gone just one of three to begin the second quarter. Here's Abaji. And the three off target. The Suns have got none of their first three shots to fall so far in the second. The shot is good by Curry. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on. Walker for three. And that'll be Milwaukee's ball as it goes out of bounds. Bucks able to keep the possession. Ooh, poked away. Curry with a steal. Back to Richardson. There's the three. Can't get it to drop. Milwaukee has gone just one of five so far this quarter from three. And we're going to have a jump ball. It'll be a jump ball. Here's Abaji. Down to five on the shot clock. And the ball's out of bounds. It was last touch by Richardson. The top scorers in the playoffs on our 2K leaderboard. In the third spot, Giannis Antetokounmpo. Perfect time to take it to another level offensively. He's really carried them at that end. Just three to shoot. Man, miss after miss for him. When you're having a quarter like this, the only beneficiary is the defense. All right, for those just joining us, we're almost two and a half minutes into the second. Here's Abaji. And the Bucks miss again. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. And what I like about it, it's been a physical brand of basketball. It's had a little sandpaper element to it. Gritty and rough, but that's how you win games. Pass to Richardson. Let's the three fly. Milwaukee with the rebound. You know, it hasn't been his best outing, but they still find themselves in the driver's seat here. Altama grabs the board. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. Curry finds Richardson. Unloads. No luck on that one. Milwaukee goes the other way with it. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Abaji can't hit. You kind of wonder where his head's at. The shot selection hasn't been there. And, of course, that one was just crazy. Curry passes to Curry. Outside Richardson. Puts up a three. Another miss. Two for nine so far. Outside Curry. Pass to Richardson. Shoots over Walker. On the wing, Curry. Give him eight. Five to shoot. There's the triple. And again, it's the Suns missing. The Bucks really having a tough go here. They've only given up two points this quarter. Here's Abaji. They double him with Curry. To win the drought. And the layup by Walker. Walker's got his first points of the night. Need to do more than that to keep him from getting the ball in the post. Exactly. I mean, deny him the ball in the first place. Don't let him get it. On the wing, Richardson. Pass to Curry from outside the arc. Left side, Curry. Back to Curry. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Curry. Curry's got five assists tonight. Curry's release is so quick. As a defender, you can't afford to give him any space. You can't lay off at all. And the basket by Abaji. The value of good ball movement isn't lost on this squad. Baseline try. Good. Curry's got four points this quarter. And he couldn't get an easier shot. 
The defense right now just looks defeated. Well, that's exactly the kind of defense that's gotten him into the hole. Walker for three. Gets it to go. That makes him two for three in this game. Really nice job moving the ball around that time, picking apart that defense. Here's Curry. And Curry throws it down. Even with the score as it is, he just keeps coming at you. Well, he only plays one way, and that's um, full throttle, all day, all the time, cold-blooded, and lethal. Timeout called, Milwaukee. shooting just around 33% since the second quarter got underway. Anadokounmpo outside. They double him with Curry. It's stolen by Curry. On the wing, Richardson. Anadokounmpo covering. Richardson, no good. He came out today planning to do as much damage from three-point range as possible. Well, it looks like it's time to change up the plan, guys. Phoenix foul. Nicholas Foster. First personal foul. And a moment here to take a look at some hustle stats for the Suns. They've really been disruptive on the defensive end, forcing turnovers and turning those turnovers into points at the other end. And how about their shot blocking tonight? I mean, creating doubt every time the ball goes up. But they're there lurking. And that's good as he hits both shots. Here's Curry. He has six. Outside Curry from deep three-point range. Walker pulls down the board. Walker's got four rebounds now. They double-team Walker. And the ball is tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. That's a jump ball. Outside Richardson. Rebounded by the Bucks. Walker's got five rebounds in the game. They double him with Curry. Launches a three. Called in by Curry. You know, he's been off tonight, off his game. At this point, he might want to focus on creating for others. First personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Suns, Curry taking two He misses the free throw. And the Bucks making a change here. Watson's checked in. And he can't make the second free throw either. Missed them both. Usually free throws are for family for him. I didn't expect that result when he stepped up there. Milwaukee, no good that time either. Yikes, how did he miss that? I mean, he makes nine out of ten of those. Oh, there's the alley! The shot from 20 feet out. And that went off the back of the rim and in. And the Suns shooting just 27% in the second quarter. Up top, Curry. He's got 12. Oh, got a piece of it. And this is who's leading the charge when it comes to rebounding here in the postseason. Well, you look at Claxton. His dominance on the boards is unquestionable. And, of course, Giannis Antetokounmpo, he's right there with those guys. Those two have thrown their bodies on the glass during this postseason, showing how badly they want to give their teams any edge they can on the boards. The Bucks shooting 32% for this game, not what they're hoping for. Pass to Watson. Here's the three. Called in by Curry. The Suns shooting at 49% so far in the game. Fires it from 18. No good. A bit long that time. He hasn't been able to find his touch this quarter. To me, it appears he's starting to lose his composure a little bit. We'll see if he can regroup and get back into a better rhythm. 
and their free throws have dropped off in this quarter. They're settling for too many jump shots right now. I, I think you're right. I mean, an up fake here or there, getting the ball inside, that's how you create high percentage offense. Smith outside. Here's Watson. On to the Kumpo inside. And it's Watson missing. It has not been his game so far. I mean, he's trying his best, giving great effort, but little has gone his way. No good on the three. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Smith with a screen on Richardson. And there's the whistle. The illegal screen is the call. One of the trickier plays to judge, but it would be hard to argue against the call. Yeah, you know, the officials aren't nearly as lenient as they used to be on that call. As a matter of fact, I know I got away with a lot of those in my playing days, but that was 40 years ago. He played well in the first quarter, but now he's taking it to the next level. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. A nice shot by Watson. Good play call and good execution. The offense running on all cylinders. Curry from deep three-point land. The quick look, no good that time. No one near him. And he hits the jumper for two. And the Suns shooting around 29% in quarter number two. Curry from deep three-point land. Sinks it. What range from downtown. And it's been tough going for their half-court offense. Yeah, this defense is in their heads, anticipating their every move. Six-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Smith left side. Here's Watson. And they get it back. Offline with a three. They've had a slight leg up on the boards and a big leg up on the scoreboard. Well, you take a look at all of the stats, the team stats, that is, and that's one of the many areas that they've had the advantage. And as a result, they've got a big lead. Woo! <laughs> B.A., that's lit. Ferocious all the way. Man, that was good. Ammonia strong, we call that. Wear that rim out. And so a pretty lopsided game through the first half. The Suns on top, up by 16. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow on 2K Sports. Hello and welcome. And here in game four, you couldn't have drawn up a better first half for the Phoenix Suns. Relying on their subs to carry the load offensively, man, that's their recipe. Some terrific role players on this team, as you would say, Shaq, the others. Yeah, you got a bunch of microwaves on that bench. Taking a look at the situation for the Phoenix Suns. They're not going anywhere, continuing to scrap and compete. Well, this is the finals, honey, and the other 28 teams in the league would be happy to trade places. Yeah, that's right. The opportunity is still there. And you know what they got to do, Shaq? G-F-U-T-B-E. Oh. Got to fight. Till the bitter end? Until the bitter end, Ernie. <laughs> Thanks, as always, for watching. Let's head back to Brian Anderson and crew for the start of the second half. Welcome you back to game four, folks. Thanks for joining us. And for the Suns, they're shooting efficiently, 50% so far. And a deep three from Curry. Rebound, Milwaukee. Walker's got rebound number seven tonight. And for Phoenix, they've got Stephen Curry. And it's Aldama in at the power forward position. Back to Anadokounmpo. And they double up Anadokounmpo. No good with the triple. And here are the Suns now. Right side Curry. Goes back up. Curry, that's good. Curry's got his third basket on the night right there. You know, at close range, Curry has a plethora of shots. You simply can't allow him to get those looks. Three-pointer. 
nails it from beyond the arc. No, they've got to make him earn those three. You play off of him, he's automatic from that distance. Outside Curry. Pass to Richardson. Over Walker. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Bucks. Yeah, just couldn't make the connection. But you appreciate their attempt at moving the ball. Milwaukee has gone one of two shooting from the perimeter since halftime. They double him with Curry. Now here's Walker. Third quarter of basketball. We're about a minute and a half in. And a bit of a battle for the ball. And the officials signal a jump ball here. It's a one-on-one -on -one situation. Tipped. Onto the Kumpo with it. He's got 14. Oh, stolen by Richardson. And now the Suns fast break. And Curry throws it down. This guy is putting on a clinic for the people. Man, I'm shocked. I can't believe he pulled that off in a real game. Well, when you know it, you got to show it. And that was our AT&T 5G Slam Cam, bringing you the sauce. Pass to Abaji. They double him with Curry. Oh, stolen by Richardson. And he lobs it up to the rim. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Suns will retain possession. He had the right idea, just couldn't come up with the swipe. You know, fellas, one second quicker, and that's going the other way. Oh, swiped away. Here's Abaji. He's got five. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Not sure what the defense was thinking. I mean, you can't leave this guy open from deep. The Suns have got just two of six in the second half. And stolen by Ana Kupo. Out to the right wing. Let's it go from deep. Pass to Walker. Second chance effort. They grab their own miss. Everything right except the finish. Have to keep focus all the way through the play. Richardson for three. And the ball is out of bounds. It was last touched by Richardson. Clock keeps going. Three minutes into the second half now. Anadokounmpo outside. Anadokounmpo is doubled. To the right side. Here's Abaji. Claxton with a rebound. Claxton's got seven rebounds in the game. He's been ice cold tonight. And, you know, you look at the scoreboard guys, they really could have used this contribution. And the Suns miss again. Well, most games he can knock it down from deep, but it just isn't there for him in this one. He's covered by Curry. Here's Abaji. Five points in the game. No luck on that one. And here's Curry. Fires from deep. That's good from Curry. On the assist by Curry. Curry's got 28 points for the game. And it looks to me like he still has some of the shooting touch that he displayed in the first. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. 14 points for him. The three-point shooting has been on point here in the second half. Exactly what the doctor ordered. Those three-point bombs will erase the deficit quickly if they can keep it up. Richardson finds Curry. And stolen by Ana Kupo. To the paint. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. Adding insult to injury with the dunk off the steal. Nice to see a good play on D. That led to some fireworks. Well, turning defense to offense, we talk about it all the time. Try to hit your opponent at the other end before they can set up the defense. And the Suns call time here. And the Suns going with a whole new group out there. And the 
free throw, no good. Here's Anadokounmpo. Lays it up and banks it in. Anadokounmpo's got 16 points now. Persistence pays for Giannis there, using his athleticism and those long arms to collect second chance opportunities for his team. And so it's the Phoenix Suns ending the quarter up 10. Really mucking it up on defense. Active hands, multiple efforts, forcing turnovers. All right, we'll get back to the action after this break. And the energy is palpable in this arena. Welcome back to the NBA Finals on 2K Sports. Milwaukee with the ball. Anacumpo is doubled. Knocked loose. It's stolen by Poole. And for the Suns, they've got D'Angelo Russell. He's out there with Jordan Poole. And it's Curry in at the small forward position. It's Walker on the wing. The three ball. And a great assist by Anacumpo. That one goes in. Anacumpo has got assist number five here tonight. Side Russell on the wing. Curry. The three. Pure from three-point range. Curry's got 31 points. Making his mark from long range today. That's his second triple of the half. His fifth overall. Walker for three. Phoenix grabs the miss. Outside Russell. Left side Curry. They double team Curry. Shoots over Walker. They get it back. Stanley. Hey, in six attempts, he's made five. Talk about efficiency. Well, I like the fact they're playing a lot more aggressively on the offensive glass in the second half. Getting a ton of second chance points as a result. Fourth quarter now. We're about a minute and a half in. And that one is hammered home. I just love the strong finish there inside. Man, he's got that dunker's mindset, doesn't he? Always ready to pounce. An absolutely tremendous athlete able to go up and finish over the biggest of defenders. Curry, no good. For Milwaukee, they've gone two of three to open the fourth quarter. Pass to Walker. And the jam by Walker. Now, B.A., you know they would love for him to get more of those opportunities. Well, that would cut into the deficit quickly if he does. Well, I like the way he capped off that drive. One hand, whole punch. Monk finds Curry. From the arc. That one, no good. Milwaukee goes the other way with it. Right side, Walker. Again, the box. Good for two. After a brutal first half from the field, their shots are finally starting to fall. Curry against Walker. 4-3. Phoenix no good that time either. He's trying to find his shot. But at some point, you have to start making these. Uncovered. Kumpo gets the assist. Walker's got nine points now in the second half. Curry against Walker. Curry passes to Poole. And the Suns miss again. The Bucks trail. And they're dialed in offensively. Sure are. Staying in attack mode and at the same time playing under control. Tried by Curry. And Curry throws it down. And he gives up some size inside, but makes a great adjustment on the finish. Yeah, you know, with that size difference, that's not an easy shot. I mean, I don't care how close to the rim he is, that's a tough shot. Timeout called, Milwaukee. Checked in for Stanley. Richardson comes in for Monk. 
And it's Curry in for Russell. All right, let's get a report from Allie. Well, over the break, I listened in on what the head coach for Milwaukee was getting across in their huddle. He was not pleased with the team's focus, saying, quote, we're being flat out reckless. We have to settle down and tighten things up. No more turnovers. Guys. Good job there, Allie. Thanks. And it's going to be a three-second call. Phoenix has gone one for five shooting from the arc here in the fourth. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. Here's Claxton. Curry finds Richardson. The three-pointer off the mark. The perimeter game has failed him thus far. Hit one from range in the first half, but nothing since. And they double up on it at Kumpo. Soft touch off the glass. And you know Coach loves seeing his offense operate at this level. Great passing out there. Five straight baskets resulting from assists. They're playing as one unit out there. Walker with a steal. Pass to Abaji. Fires the three. And it's Richardson with the rebound. Richardson's got rebound number seven tonight. And stolen by Anadokounmpo. Oh, and the jam by Giannis. Really amazing. Absolutely astonishing how accomplished Anadokounmpo is on defense. I mean, he's disruptive wherever he is on the floor defensively. Back to Curry. On the take. Having another steal. And that's his sixth steal of the night. Imposing his will at the defensive end. You gotta love it. The Suns leading. And Curry throws it down. Oh, man. Talk about hang time. What a wicked double clutch finish. Hey, when you have that kind of space, you're allowed to get fancy. And space is what he had, fellas. Soft defense there. Down low. Here's Anadokounmpo. Pass to Abaji from deep. And a great assist by Anadokounmpo. And that one goes in. Anadokounmpo's got assist number 10 tonight with that last one. Curry finds Richardson. Curry, a screen on Anadokounmpo. Back to Curry. And he lays it up and in. Curry's got 37. Deep into the game, you rely on players like him to keep delivering. Anadokounmpo is doubled. Walker against Richardson. And another three for Milwaukee. When this fellow starts knocking down threes, watch out, folks. Just pouring it on in this half. Curry passes to Richardson. Curry, a screen on Anadokounmpo. Here's Richardson. And stolen by Anadokounmpo. It's Walker on the wing to take the lead. And it's Stephen Curry with the rebound. Curry's got rebound number eight here already in the game. Beyond the arc. The shot misses. Here's Milwaukee. They're on an 18-6 run. Anadokounmpo can't connect. When you're casual with the ball, it can come back to bite you. Yeah, B.A., playing loose can help you and hurt you. They really need to tighten it up. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. And he got the whistle on the way up, so he'll be headed to the line for a pair. The defense there doing whatever they can to protect the rim. Definitely saved the layup with that foul, and they'll make him earn them from the line, and that's what you want to see. So he gets them both. The Suns have gone just 6 of 14 in this final quarter. Now here's Curry. Anadokounmpo with the block. Hey, when Giannis is lurking nearby, you got to be careful because his wingspan can erase a lot of shots. To the wing, right side. The three is up. 
Ooh, that one makes him 7 for 14. Got a nice rhythm going here today. He's done so much damage from beyond the arc. And he's still hitting those big shots. And it's a big one. What a performance from Long Ring. Remarkable. Milwaukee has gone 4 of 8 from three-point land during the fourth. Pass to Walker to take the lead. Phoenix grabs the miss. Claxton's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Here's Curry. A great job to establish position and square up. Excellent example of toughness and physicality on defense. Got his nose right in the middle of things and made a play. And the Bucks shooting around 44%. Not bad. He's covered by Curry. Oh, and they take the lead. He's got 24. Man, he's got a lot of firepower right now. I mean, what a half he's had. On the wing, Curry. Walker covering. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Bucks. Well, you know, they've been tremendous, I think, when it comes to sharing the basketball. You know, getting guys involved on the plays and creating offensive opportunities for everybody. Equal opportunity offense is fun to watch. And also attacking and transition has been working for them. I mean, we credit them for running the break well and being opportunistic. And so Curry nails both of them. This is what makes him special, his ability to come through in these spots. Cool against Hunter de Kumpo. The three is up. Trey. And the Bucks lead by three. I mean, I guess they're willing to give him that shot. <laughs> they may want to rethink that strategy. Though. Here's Curry. And Curry throws it down. And one move ahead of the defense. A solid pick. And then the monster dunk to complete the play. Well done. Boy, picture perfect teamwork that time, guys. One guy sacrificing for the other. That's how you succeed in this league. And he says right back at you with a big dunk of his own. And just shredding apart the defense with his passing. He's helping to pace this offense so well. You know, numbers don't always tell the story, guys, but his assist totals do paint the picture here. I mean, he's got everybody involved. Curry with it. Walker picks him up defensively. Deflected! Out of against Richardson. Yet another assist. That makes 15 assists. He has been one step ahead of the defense all game long. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. He gets the first, and that brings him within five. nails both of them. Wow. Coming through for his team at the line and cutting this down to a very tight game. The Bucks shooting the rock well at 46%. Guarded by Richardson. Pass to Walker. Out to the right wing. To the paint. And he throws it down with one hand. I'll tell you what, his vertical is awesome off the charts. A short center who still makes his presence felt. That one misses. Crucial possession right here. The crowd is on edge. Inside. The kick out to Poole. Pass to Richardson. This one for three. Rebounded by the Bucks. At this point, I'm not sure if it's the play calling or the player himself. Ooh, he doesn't hit the first. That was the one they really wanted. He's got one more, though. And he's able to hit the second one. And that makes it a seven-point lead. Phoenix calls timeout. They're behind by seven. 24 seconds left in the fourth. enough time for them to get back in this game. Not by a long shot. It's all but official. He got a piece of it. And he recovers it. Here's Claxton. 
the kick out. Curry. And Curry throws it down. And in traffic, he uses the reverse to keep the shot blocker at bay. What an incredible move. Not everyone has that kind of skill. No, that was outstanding, guys. And an intentional foul right there. So the first one drops, and that increases the lead to six. And so he drops them both, and it's a seven-point game. The 11-footer, no good that time. That's tipped. And so it's Milwaukee with the W. And with this win, they'll jump out to a 3-1 lead in the series. A commanding start. And they can't afford to take their foot off the gas pedal. The job isn't done yet, but it's close to being all she wrote. And now let's check in with Allie LaForce with the player of the game. Allie. Giannis, a tremendous performance. What enabled you to win this game so convincingly? Uh, it was a team effort. I think we came out, we did not mess around with the game. We, came, we did our job, we defended, we moved the ball. That's why we were able to uh, close the game. Giannis always recognizing the importance of his teammates. Thanks so much, Giannis. Thanks, Ali. Great interview once again. Game four of the NBA Finals is in the books. For Grant Hill, Clark Kellogg, and Ali LaForce, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching. Now it's time for the New Balance Player of the Game, Giannis Antetokounmpo.